A recent decision from the Amazon-owned company Ring will not allow police and fire departments to request users' doorbell video footage. But here at home, the company's Neighbors app could be used to receive video from its users. Gio Battaglia talked with local law enforcement to find out if there are other ways they'll be able to use residents' video for investigations. He joins us now in studio with more on this story. Gia. Adam, Teresa, good evening. The Monroe County Sheriff's Office says a program to better utilize residents' camera footage was already in development, but the recent announcement from Ring moved the launch date up a little sooner than they had anticipated. This is a system set up so that we have a better response and a more focused response for schools, private businesses, um, different types of entities. Connect Monroe County, a new public safety program from Monroe County, will allow deputies to request footage from registered users through Fuchsia's Connect to help with their investigations. If we have a crime that occurs in a neighborhood and we want to look for, you know, doorbell video or other types of video in that area that might help us solve that crime, then we can pull up on the screen and know where there are some cameras, reach out to those people directly either by email or phone and request the video. Sergeant Greg Wildman showed me how the program works. Registration simply asks for a resident's name, the location of their camera, email, and phone. And one thing deputies want to emphasize is that they do not have constant access to a resident's doorbell footage. Registering does not obligate anybody to share their video with us, it's strictly a registration. Uh, the other part is that at no point do we actually have access to live video in anyone's residential cameras. When they need it, deputies tell me they will reach out to registered residents and request access to look at video from a specific time frame. MCSO says in addition to residents, schools and businesses can integrate their cameras into the program for a small fee. If you think of, you know, a school district that uh, to if they had any kind of you know our worst fear type of call within that school we could immediately not only have their panic app but also their video and what that allows us to do in our response is better set up uh, tactical resources our approach uh, find out where the perpetrators park their car and how many of them are there Residents can begin their free registration now. We have those links over on rochesterfirst.com. In studio, Geo Bataglia News 8, back to you.